Hello, in this video, I would like to show you how to upgrade this 10.4 inch ANC screen from 2CC FLM to our UB54 series LED kit. This series kit cut for the smaller screen, it comes with a smaller driver, it's called AMS610 UB. So this is a 10.4 inch screen, let's set aside LED kit for a second. Take a look at the screen number, it's NL6448BC33-59. NL6448 BC 33-59. This is a quite common one. To upgrade from CCFL to LED is really kind of straight and forward and easy. You see this button that's for holding the reflectors. Maybe you see better, see that? You push it down, push it down. Okay, so you push it down. Okay, maybe you see better. Push it down, grab the wire, pull it on. So push it down. This one's a little bit tricky, I gotta use a long nose. Sometimes when a um, the CCF is on for a while, it melts down the plastic a little bit, make it a little bit difficult to pull, see? Use a long nose, just push it out, side that side. Take a look at the screen, okay. So this one can mount in, but because the country, because it's on the bottom is a little bit narrow, so, um, Usually, I would recommend either you can add any material. Usually, most case would be a double side tip. I'll show you later on, on the bottom. So basically, let's remove this. Okay. Okay. All right. Take it out. Set it aside. All right. This is a reflector. You see, it's not flat. So usually, I would either recommend you using a double side tip on the bottoms and on both sides, and then you mount it. Remember, the light wire is coming from this side. But this time, I want to show you some new stuff, the silicons. Spray it a little bit better. I'm going to cut it. Okay, you can put as many as you want to. Usually, I will put like maybe three. Put one in the center. Show you. Okay. Once here. Let me put it in so I can show you later on. The silicon uh, spreads heat faster. But another thing is so that when you put the silicon, that means double side tape won't stick to it. So I show you, we're going to add a little bit super glue on both ends of the strip, so make sure it stay there. Alright. So because the bottom, it's not flat, so we're going to raise up a little bit. You see this? So we're going to mount like this. So basically, you can either peel it or not peel. That's okay because it won't stick anyway. So here we go. You're going to, because silicon is kind of soft, so you can push it, force it to form a flat bottoms. You see this? Okay. So after that, usually I would suggest that you just add a couple drops of the super glue on both ends. Just make sure it stays there. So stick to, stick to. All right, you don't have to let it dry, but you know, it's, it's, then right now, basically you just slice right back. Yes. Slice right back. You can add a piece of tape here just to uh, secure the wires. Which is I usually I I do this and just like this. Make sure I don't block the screw hole. So you don't you know I at this point I do not recommend you to put a like aluminum tip on it because if you put it in and uh, the heat won't come out easy. So just leave it like that and um, this end connect to a. Uh, LED drivers, okay. So this one you can stick any way you want to because this new driver we put a special coating. Even though you stick to the metal, it won't shut out. Here we go, this is the connection. So most of the NEC uh, inverters, especially for 10.4 inch screen like this two, okay, they do not have an enable voltage. So basically, um, what I would recommend is that you can short it out between uh, VIN to ENA on CN1, which is smaller connectors. 
If you need more information, you come to our site and visit tech support, you're gonna see it. So very easy. When you shut out this one, the only thing you need to connect is red to the positive, black to the negative. That's it. Thank you for watching.